again. With this question, the first thing we have to do is show that 1 minus 2i is a root of this equation, and then hence factorize that expression. Okay, so let's show that that's a root. That is a, a root means that this stuff will equal 0. So let's, let's put the numbers in and see what happens. So we're going to get um, 1 plus minus 2i cubed plus 2 into 1 minus 2i squared minus 3 into 1 minus 2i plus 20. So that one cubed 1 minus 2i equals that one. And that equals uh, binomial expansion coefficients will be 1, 3, 3, 1. So we're going to get 1 um, minus 3 times 1 times 2i. I've put the negative outside the front there. Plus 3, which should be 1 squared, times 1 times 2i squared, plus 1 lot at the end. I've done the negatives as I've gone along because I've got one of them so it's a negative and then two so it's a positive and then three so it's a negative. Then we expand the second part plus two one squared minus one two is it two i plus two i squared. multiply that out so I'm going to get minus 3 plus 6i plus 20 which equals now making it all look as simple as I can that's 1 3 2 is a 6i so it's minus 6i 2 squared is 4 4 3 is a 12 and that's i squared 2 cubed is 8 8i cubed plus 2 times that gives me 2 minus 2 2 is a 4 and 4 2 is a 8 i 2 squared is 4 4 2 is a 8 and that's i squared and then we get minus 3 plus 20 I've got I'll put the plus 6i minus 3 that is plus 17 nearly there Let's collect some numbers together. So I've got 1 and 2 makes 3, 17 makes 20. I've got minus 6i, 12i squared, i squared is minus 1, so that gives me minus 12. 8i cubed, i squared is minus 1, times that will give me plus 8 and there's still 1i to go. And we've got the minus 8i. i squared is minus 1, so that gives me minus 8 plus the 6i. Now we're just about to get there, and hopefully it's all going to work out. Let's get the numbers part here. I've got 20 minus 12 minus 8, which fortunately does equal 0. And I've got minus 6i plus 8i that's 2i minus 8i plus 6i and fortunately that does equal 0 0 as required so that's that first bit all done and now we have to go on and hence factorise into linear factors I think I'll do that on a, a second following on video